have no option. You must run. Fuck your excuses. Fuck your goddamn excuses. They are worthless to me. They are meaningless. This is your wake up call, motherfucker. This is your week to make it happen. Welcome to the first episode of the Road to 300 Kilogram Deadlift, guys. I'm very, very excited for this series. I'm honestly so gassed. The feeling that I'm going to get from just building the blocks needed to get to the 300 Kilogram Deadlift is going to be insane. And I'm willing to put in the graph for it, guys. And I'm, I'm going to try and motivate you guys. I want to talk you guys for the top, my thought process every time I get into the gym. What, what, what are the kind of things that goes through my mind before I do my sets? How do I mentally prepare for my, my workouts, my sets? What kind of accessory exercises I'm doing at the gym? All of this kind of stuff. So if you are interested in, in building strength and acquiring the right mental edge, then I will ask you to please leave a like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss future videos as I'm going to be talking about these things in depth. So guys, this is my first episode, guys. This is the first series as I'm, I'm actually building up to a heavy single of 280 kilograms. As you can see here, all the warm-up sets have been going pretty well. Um, this is 240. Um, it actually moved pretty well this day. Not too bad. I'm always very critical of my form. And in the lower sets, I'm always trying to tweak around little things, especially in the sumo deadlift that could make my, my form more efficient but here we go 280 kilograms how is it going to move not too bad not too bad i did have a bit of a shaky leg at the end of it but that's something that i usually get um potentially it might be to fatigue or form it's something i'm still trying to figure out if you get this if you get this and you have a problem with this as well please leave a comment down below so after I finished that set guys, I did some pause deadlifts. This is just to build up strength of the floor and, and it really, really just helps you to knock it down on how you're meant to be pushing off the floor and then continue the continual drive up throughout the rest of the lift. But yeah guys, this is the deadlift portion. The next is going to be highlights. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll meet you guys in the next episode.